It's winter time in Tasmania, it's no time for catching lizards, but it's lizard week. So what we're going to do, we're going to be drawing some lizards, taking some requests, and looking over some of my old footage of some lizard videos that I've videoed in the past and may not have shown for various reasons. So let's have a look at some more lizards for lizard week. I am the snake artist and my mission in life is to get people to appreciate art and wildlife. I love it when an animal can adapt to a city. Right by this waterway in the city of Miami, we have the green iguana sitting around looking like a gorgeous little dinosaur. And that's one of the reasons I love iguanas, because they look like dinosaurs. And because they're tough and they can live in cities. Although probably not a native, probably is introduced, but Still, like everything in Florida, is most of the reptiles introduced. Sketching in the field, you've got to be fast. And so sometimes it's good to practice speed. Drawing things fast can help your art ability grow quite quick. You can achieve better results often. Your lines look freer when you learn how to draw fast. Sometimes it ends up as a scribble. But if you're learning to draw, I encourage people to draw fast. Today... I'm going to challenge myself. I've got a timer here. I'm going to go for one minute and see how much of an iguana I can draw in a minute. And it's all good for you, not just as a growing artist, but as a practiced artist to keep that exercise going. Ready, steady, go. Um, back leg. Oh, sitting in some grass. That's grass. So the neck a bit. Head. Shade. Shade. Oh, that takes up time. It's the spines on the back. Damn, halfway through. I. It's just not enough. Should give myself five minutes. My feet starting to look like a lizard. Oh, it's confusing there. Oh man! Right. That's my iguana. And there goes my subject. Next time I'm going to be doing a much more in-depth how to draw the iguana because I can't pass up the opportunity to do an iguana. They've got too much beautiful detail. So I'll say goodbye to this iguana. He's gone for a swim. And we'll see you in the next video when we're going to be drawing the iguana. You know how to draw the iguana.